I'm a patient of Dr. Cueva's. My name is Ryan Pointer. Ryan, what did Dr. Cueva do for you? Uh, I, I talked to Dr. Cueva about uh, my snoring problem. My wife had been complaining about me snoring, and uh, I talked to Dr. Cueva to see if there was anything that he could do about it. So he informed me that he could do a sleep study and set me up with a mouthpiece. So that's what we did. How is the process of getting the mouthpiece and fittings and? It, you know, it's really seamless. Uh, it's you know, there's a two-week process that you're waiting for the mouthpiece after you have it fitted. Uh, um, so it was pretty seamless, just waiting the two weeks after you get your sleep study. When he gets the results from that. Then uh, they do a fitting, and then after they do the fitting, then it's another two weeks for you to get your mouthpiece in. And how's it, is it comfortable for you? Do you find it annoying, or? You know, the first two to three weeks, uh, it was uncomfortable, you know, having something foreign in your mouth, and, uh, you know, we did one adjustment period, but after that, it's been, you know, now I'm probably three and a half weeks in, and it's awesome. Uh, I'm sleeping better than I've ever slept. I'm dreaming again, which, you know, it's one of those things that you didn't think about, but I'd stop dreaming with the sleep apnea because I, I was never getting the proper sleep pattern, so. Oh, good. Um, do you feel that, um, what kind of job are you, what kind of occupation are you in that this helps you feel better? Well, I'm, I'm a firefighter, so in order to have the proper amount of rest is, uh, in order to have that proper amount of rest is vital to be able to perform my job. So uh, getting that sleep on my days off, you know, so I work a 24 hour shift, so having the energy and being vital enough to do my job is important. Okay, if, um, if you had to if re recommend, would you recommend this type of sleep device for anybody else? Absolutely. I, I'd heard that there, you know, there were several options. Surgery was an option. Uh, they call CPAP, which we use those on ambulances. And there's, you know, it was the CPAP's a mask that they put on your face. And, you know, it's just something I didn't believe I could tolerate. Uh, you know, sounding like Darth Vader sleeping every night and, you know, laying next to my wife who was wearing earplugs, you know, to get away from my snoring and then have a mask that sounded like Darth Vader wouldn't be any good. So, you know, doing this was, you know, I thought was the best option and, you know, I, I've been happy with it.